According to an article published by Militarleak on June 26, 2023, the Polish armed forces recently took possession of 35 domestically produced Smija 4x4 long-range reconnaissance vehicles LRRV, which were strategically deployed in military units stationed near Poland's eastern borders. In response to the presence of Wagner mercenary fighters, who are allied with Russia, Poland has taken measures to relocate some military units closer to the Belarusian border. This move comes amidst reports of escalating military maneuvers and pressure on the geopolitical front. In a televised Security Council meeting, Russian President Vladimir Putin issued a stern warning, stating that any aggression against Belarus would be perceived as an attack on Russia, potentially leading to significant consequences. The Zmija, also known as the Viper, is a long-range reconnaissance vehicle developed for the Polish Armed Forces as part of their Armed Forces Technical Modernization Plan. Its purpose is to bolster Poland's defense capabilities by providing advanced reconnaissance capabilities in challenging terrains and adverse weather conditions. In April 2015, the Polish Ministry of Defense MOD, announced a tender for 118 light-armored long-range reconnaissance vehicles as part of the Zmija Viper program. This initiative was a significant aspect of Poland's ambitious Armed Forces Technical Modernization Plan, which involved substantial investments between 2013 and 2022. It was first unveiled in Western Europe at Eurosatry 2018. The Mija Viper LRRV is based on the team concept Virus 4, Virus 4. It was selected as the winning vehicle out of three candidates evaluated for Poland's Ministry of National Defense Mija or Viper, a requirement for a three-man light strike vehicle, Leki Pojazd Udezinyowi or LPU in Polish. The Virus 4 was developed by the Team Concept Consortium, consisting of the vehicle conversion company concept of Bielsko Byla and PHO, Polskiego Holdingu Abronigo, of Warsaw. The procurement of the Zmija long-range reconnaissance vehicles was made through a contract signed on September 6, 2017 between the Armament Inspectorate and a consortium comprised of Paul Ski holding a Brony SPZOO and Concept SPZOO. According to the agreement, a total of 118 Zmija vehicles are scheduled to be delivered to the Polish Armed Forces. The first batch, consisting of 25 vehicles, was successfully delivered in December 2021 and is now in service with the 2nd and 9th Reconnaissance Regiments, with two of them assigned to the Land Forces Training Center. The Zmija LRRV was officially deployed on December 7, 2021, to the Polish-Belarusian border for patrols over challenging terrain. These light reconnaissance vehicles are scheduled to participate in the Grand Parade on Poland's Armed Forces Day, which will take place on August 15, 2023, showcasing their importance within Poland's defense strategy. The Zmija is a production vehicle based on the Mitsubishi L200 pickup truck and incorporates technical specifications that highlight its capabilities. It is equipped with a 2.4-litre, 2,442 cubic centimetres four-cylinder 4N4 four diesel engine paired with a 6F1 R manual gearbox for power distribution. The vehicle features a four-wheel drive system with a central differential, reduction gears, and three differential locks, aiming to enhance its off-road performance. The suspension comprises independent double wishbone coil springs on all four wheels, while the rear axle remains rigid. Braking is achieved through disc brakes at the front and drum brakes at the rear, offering effective stopping capabilities. The vehicle has a ground clearance of 245 mm, an approach angle of 40 degrees, and a departure angle of 65 degrees with the rear load platform raised or 37 degrees with the platform lowered. It is also designed to handle steep terrain with a ramp angle of 40 degrees and can tackle a 100% gradient. It is built with a high-strength tubular construction frame, and its body components are made from composite materials, aiming for durability and weight reduction. Despite not being armored, the vehicle meets Level 1 Stanag 4569 Annex B standards, thanks to spatial flexible ballistic shields on the floor that mitigate the effects of explosions from underneath. The Zmija has a gross vehicle weight, GVW, of 2,700 kg and can carry a maximum payload of 900 kg. The Zmija LRRV is described as an open-body vehicle designed to transport a crew of four, offering increased capacity compared to the original three-person design. The vehicle can carry cargo or up to four additional personnel under canvas in the rear. It comes equipped with a ZMT-ZSU-01 12.7mm remote weapon station, 
featuring uncooled thermal and television cameras, as well as a laser rangefinder. Designed for extended field operations, the Zmedia comes with a basic weather protection kit, featuring removable doors and windscreen panels. The lightweight seats are constructed using webbing material for practicality and weight reduction. To enhance its self-sufficiency in the field, the vehicle includes a lightweight rear platform for external transport of rucksacks and light cargo. Additionally, its heliportable design allows for easy transportation by helicopters to various locations.